Hello guys, welcome to your science class. Today's topic is the absorption and reflection of sound. Absorption. It sounds like a sponge. Let's see. When a sound travels from one medium to another, part of the sound is absorbed. As you can see in the video. The same thing happens inside your house. Sounds are absorbed by the furniture, rugs and curtains. Yes, like a sponge. Look at this picture. All the objects that you see are absorbing sound. The reflection of sound. The sound coming from the radio travels through the air in all directions and hits the walls. Also my voice. I'm speaking now and at the end all my voice, my voice travels through the air in all directions and also hits the walls and also is absorbed by the furniture, by the curtains, and all the things that I have around. As we have seen, one part of the sound is absorbed by the wall, and the other part is reflected and returned. When a sound is reflected, it changes direction and loses energy. In other words, it loses its intensity. It means that what I am saying here is losing the intensity as it gets to the rooms in my house. Because sound is reflected and also is absorbed. The quantity of sound that the material reflects depends on the material's characteristics. For example, concrete reflects sound very well. When I say concrete, I mean the wall, I mean the floor, okay? This is concrete, all right? On the other hand, a curtain absorbs part of it and reflects the rest. This is made of cloth, right? Now, what is an echo? Echo, echo, echo. <laughs> Do you know what produces an echo? When a sound is reflected and then travels back to the place where it started after a certain amount of time, it produces an echo. Look at the picture. Sound is traveling and it takes a time to come back, to return. There are places where if a person shouts or talks, they hear the voice again a moment later, which means they are hearing their echo. Next time you go to an open place, I mean to mountains or to the ocean or somewhere without walls, try it and shout a word and you listen it again. Thank you very much for your attention. See you later, alligators. Bye-bye.